Hi everybody, thanks for watching. Today I'm going to show you how to remove an old broken debris chute from a John Deere lawn tractor and put on a new one. Uh, what I mean by debris chute is this black thing that angularly sits on the side of your uh, deck. It's where the discharged grass comes shooting out. And these things are usually a heavy, heavy duty PVC or plastic. And occasionally, if you're like me, you clip a tree or hit a ditch or... Uh, come across something and over years they get torn up. They're not terribly difficult to replace But if you haven't seen it done before, uh, it's always nice to see someone do it and show you a few steps So that's what I'm going to do today uh, You can order these things online or from a local John Deere dealer I don't actually remember the price I paid for this one So I'll look it up and do a current price as of the spring of 2021 but it's not terribly difficult, like I said, so let's just get to it. Here's the new one. It's going to eyeball it real quick. Looks like it's going to fit. Here's a view from the other side. This whole bar is held down with a little clip here at the end. I'm just going to use a screwdriver, prop it off. We can reuse this clip. We'll just flatten it out. There it is. Put that where you'll find it. And this chute is spring loaded. The spring goes on a little groove on the mower deck. That's right there. I'm going to pound this out. Okay, holding the spring there. And there's another look at that. The spring goes in the groove right there. This we don't need. You can, if you want, take these off. These are 13 millimeter or half inch uh, nuts that go on the bolts. The bolts have that square fitting. I loosened it earlier thinking I was gonna have to take it off, but I don't think I have to. Um, it's another good ch chance to uh, pound out a bent pin, if that's the case. This one's bent a little bit, but it came out pretty easy, so I'm probably going to use it as is. Okay, the tricky piece is going to be this spring. It has to be torqued just right. The shorter end goes on the rear bolt, and the longer end is going to hold the chute down itself. So this long end has to be bent so it'll fit in this clip. So well, the way I'm going to do it is get everything ready. Put the chute in place, put that long piece on the chute itself, okay, get the spring just right, and I might have to get a, uh, a spacer or a board or something to hold the chute up in place. Okay, I've got a kid's bicycle helmet holding that in position. I've got the long piece of the spring that has to hold this down. It's going to go in that groove. The short piece is going to be against the uh, mower deck here. So I've got to get it in the right position. And There we go. Start pushing that pin through. Okay, I'm gonna get a little hammer or something to tap that through. And you can see that we've got the spring here and the spring here. Keeps that in tension. And now I'm gonna go grab a hammer and flatten out this little clip. Put it back on here and we'll be done. Push it back onto the pin. There's a little, little groove there that it'll snap onto. There we go. New shoots in place. Bicycle helmet's still there. 
take off the dealer tag. That's how you replace a uh, discharge chute on a John Deere deck. This is a 54-inch deck, but they're all the same in principle. Hope this helps. Thanks for watching.